thing, I also created my um, my smoking hot deal of the day video right here. You probably can't hear it, but um, in this one, I'm actually showing a property. And if it were closer, this one's about a half an hour away. If it were closer, I would go and uh, get an in-person video of it. However, uh, it's a little bit, uh, you know, it's a little bit of a travel. And just to sort of unpack here and, and show how the sausage is made a little bit. This is an EXP brokerage listing. It's not my listing, but it's with the brokerage. I found it. I actually called Nate this morning or Nathan, I'm sorry, Nathan this morning. And I said, hey, what's, what's, what's the deal with this? It's been listed for a while. It's had several price reductions. You know, hey, what's going on with this? He gave me the backstory, some information. I said, hey, you know, uh, I do this thing where I feature a property every day. Are you cool if I feature the property? Talk about it a little bit, see if we can drum up some interest. And he was like, yeah, of course. There's a lesson in that. When I have previously asked for permission on that, I go right for the ask. I think one of the reasons why it became a no-brainer is I first asked like, hey, what's up with it? What's going on? Right? Yeah. So he opened up with, to me. And uh, honestly, I don't even need his permission in this case because we have blanket permission. It's an EXP Realty brokerage listing. But uh, I think if you're asking for permission yeah. to do something like this, just just build some rapport and relationship first, right? No, I've, um, I've made that call before. That's a really good tip, you know, because you, usually you're going to say, hey, uh, you got that listing over there. And you, yeah, how else do you say that? Well, you just say, what's been going on with it? Like you're saying, yes. structurally, that's a really good script and it does break the ice.